filming a Primark new look boots and the shawl all into one. Now I have already filmed this once. I've actually filmed it last week and I went to edit it during the week and it was just so out of focus and blurry and the lighting was just so bad and I just can't have that now because I now have good quality in lighting I want to stick with that throughout so I didn't just want to have one rubbish video so I decided to film it again. That does mean though that now I have worn a lot of the items, the tags aren't on them anymore, they're not in the bags, yeah, so it will be without that but I will put the prices on the screen as I go along, yeah, and I will get into it. So first of all I'm going to go with Lush, now I've got two products from Lush, i got the Autumn Leaf Bath Bomb and so it smells quite citrusy in some places and then in others quite cottony, like cotton fresh. I don't know what it is and it doesn't actually describe the scent of it but it smells amazing whatever it is and I can't wait to use it because it's just going to make my bath look very colourful. Anyway I hope it doesn't like leave like a horrible brown colour like if all the colours intermingle. I hope it leaves a nice pretty colour. And then the other item I got was the Christmas Penguin Bubble Bar and this smells just very spicy like that Christmas spice like maybe cinnamon just very Christmassy and the reason why I got this one is because last year if you haven't seen my little shawl I will link it below I got basically everything in the Christmas range um, apart from the Christmas penguin bubble bar because it sold out at my store um, so I just thought I had to get it while I could before it all runs out next place I went to was Boots so the first item I got was the Avene that's how I say it sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong Clenin's my cellar water now the reason why I get this one if I don't know if you know but this costs 16 pound and I know you can get like the Garnier one for like four pound but the reason why I have to buy this one is because I have problematic skin and I have been using this one for probably a year maybe more and since then my skin's been so good so I just don't want to risk using another one I want to stick to the products that I know is best they also this lasts me for five or six months anyway so it's not that much when you come to think of it um but I have to for my skin and then I got the bourgeois Bridge Edition Velvet in the colour Plum Plum Girl 14 and it's actually the colour I'm wearing at the minute so yeah a very more kind of ready plum than purpley plum if you get what I mean um but yeah I like the feel of it it takes a few minutes to dry because obviously it's a liquid lipstick but um I'm liking it and it smells like a berry when you do you know what I mean like the scent of it is berry which is just amazing as well yeah very berry like and I love it and it matches my top so you know win win Another product I got was a Maybelline Colour Tattoo 24 Hour and I got it in the shade Creme de Nude 93. It's just a simple base colour to put on before any eyeshadow to make it pop more or just to hide any lines or discoloration on your eyelids if you don't want to wear eyeshadow that day and you just want to look a bit more awake which I need to look like most days because I look very tired if I don't have makeup on. Um, yeah it's quite, I wouldn't, I would say if you have quite um tan skin don't it wouldn't look good if you got i mean like this suits best for pale skin like i have next shop is new look um first of all in the teen section i got this roller neck black and dark gray with silver specks in just thin long sleeve tops and it looks like it was going to be that itch type material but it's not it's just the pattern's so pretty. I actually bought this for school because it's we have a black, grey and white dress code so obviously this fits perfectly. But it's that type of thing where you can wear it smart, you can wear it casual. It's glittery, well not glittery but it's, it's got that shimmer so it'll be good for, you know, dressing up as well. So yeah, love that. I also got another jumper from the teen section. I lied, this was actually from the adult section. This one's from the teen section. And it's kind of just like a slightly high neck um top it's grey it's got white stripes at the bottom and it looks like it's that type of jumper material that's quite thin but it still keeps you warm if you know what i mean um but yeah it fits really well so yeah that's that and then i've just got some simple black jeans also from the teen section i have to get them in an age 13 and the legs are too, still too long of me and I'm 16 and that shows how short I am. The age 13 clothes are still too long of me. Yeah. 
but yeah simple pair of black jeans i've never actually owned a pair of black jeans before which sounds crazy but i'm more of a leggings person but re recently i've been becoming like a jean person and they're actually really comfy and they are high waist skinny fit so i'm going to go in with primark so i got quite a few jumpers from here the first one was this black gray and white checkered one and this was slightly more expensive than the other ones by two pound but it's like a warm material and it is so 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 warm i wore it to school the other day and it just kept me warm all day like honestly you'd think this is got to be more expensive for what it is because of how good the material is it's just so warm and i love it the next two jumpers i got i got the same but in two colors first of all in like a stony color and yeah it's just the simple jumper really um it, again it fits really nice it's warm everything you need really and then i got it in a burgundy color because i think burgundy suits me the best like i'm wearing a burgundy top now and it's very christmasy color so that's literally all i wear at christmas time the shade burgundy or khaki yeah they're the two shades i wear the most so the next item i got was a black kind of see-through shirt it's can you see that? So it's got like a pocket on either side and it's long sleeve but you can roll it up to make it three quarter length and yeah it is very see through like you can see me through it. So yeah I'll definitely wear a vest under that or a long sleeve top. So again it's going to be great for spring when I need like something cool but obviously it's good for winter now because I can layer it. And yeah it just looks very smart and it's different to a white shirt. And the last two items I got were Harry Potter. Now if you know me I love Harry Potter and they're basically the only pyjamas I've been wearing at the minute so I thought I'd get myself some more. Um, this was actually in the jumper section and it says I don't go looking for trouble, trouble usually finds me. Harry Potter quote. And yeah so I've wore it as like a slouchy jumper and it's a pyjama top. I probably wouldn't wear it out um, because it kind of just looks like, like your pyjamas but again it's so 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 warm it's like i don't know if you can tell but it's that kind of like fleecy material and like kind of like velvet like if you get what i mean it's so 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 soft so now i've saved the best item until last which is my harry potter onesie look i absolutely love it it's my favorite thing this is all i've been wearing non-stop since i bought it excuse this top underneath so yeah you got my harry potter onesie so my favorite thing about it is the hood like just look how cool it is i love it so 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 much and can i just say it's the warmest and comfiest thing i've ever worn like it's as soft as my blanket which i thought was the softest thing but now this is even softer and i love it anyway so let's describe it so you've got burgundy and navy stripes then you've got the gryffindor emblem seven harry's quidditch number says h dot potter you got a nice little harry potter thing on the zip honestly what more could you need i love it so much so if you are a big harry potter fan i would say get this while you can because it will probably sell out quite fast there was only four actually left when i went to get mine and even though i've got this in a size small it drowns me like the legs are so 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 long of me but it makes it even comfy i say oh well so that was my new look primark lush and boots haul i hope you liked it if you're new here remember to subscribe like and comment thanks for watching and i'll see you in my next video